a marvelous Monday to all of you. I am back with an another episode of Monday Motivation. I hope you're having a great day and a great time and may this week be the most productive week of all time. In today's message, I'd like to share with the leadership message that I have been carrying with me for the past probably 15 years or more. The message is probably something you have heard from me before either in an event or maybe from one of my writings. It's called everything rises and falls on leadership. If there's one powerful message about leadership, leading people, guiding people, mentoring people, this is the message. Everything rises and falls on leadership and the question is what it means. It simply means that everything that you do from your personal discipline, from the way you respect other people, from the way you do things, it always rises and falls on your leadership. So here's how it happens. So let's say if this is the level that you lead, everything you do will hit here and it won't go above unless you do whatever it takes to elevate your leadership level. And to elevate your leadership level, there are different things that you can do. Remember, if your team is not performing, it's not necessarily because they are not incompetent or not that they don't have the right skills or maybe even that your organization doesn't have, not, not necessarily doesn't have the resources. It probably could be related to you as a leader because as leaders, it's our responsibility to be in charge of the people, taking care of them. So their happiness at work, the way they come to work, the way they even walk to work, it all depends on how excited they are because they're going to come and work for you the next day. So in order for you to elevate the leadership level, remember everything rises and falls on leadership. So to elevate this leadership plate, here are three tips that I would like to give you. Number one, practice good leadership every single day. I'm sure you attend leadership classes, programs and training activities. Take time to learn to study. Apply them. Number two, be the best possible role model you can be. And I know you can do it. You see what's lacking in today's world is not leadership competencies. I believe most of us, we have good leadership competencies. Maybe some of us may lack in different areas because there is really no perfect leader. We are all in progress, but we can always be a good role model. And number three is lead yourself, look after yourself. If you don't look after yourself, or if you're not able to look after yourself, you can't lead other people. And if you do these three things every single day and be intentional about it, you will notice that your leadership lift and the leadership lead will start elevating to a totally a new level. And every time you do something to look after yourself, it helps you to improve your leadership efficiency, you become more productive, your people start seeing it, and they will perform at a totally different level. Remember, everything rises and falls in your leadership. If something doesn't go right, don't blame other people. Look at your own leadership. And I do that every single day. I ask this question every day. How can I improve and be a better leader? I'm not a perfect leader. I will never be. I don't intend to be. But I can tell you, I intend to improve on my leadership every single day. I hope you enjoyed this message. And let's face the week with excitement and energy. May all of you be blessed. Thank you.